Looks like a good time, eh? You got the bros dancing, man, with their hoods up, throwing the arms in the air, shaking their booty holes like they're a goddamn OnlyFans creator. Looks like a hell of a time. Oh, so much fun, right? Incorrect. No. What I am about to tell you guys is firstly horrible for the people affected. However, if we didn't have such tragic events, we couldn't laugh at idiots like this. Now, again, I want to make it clear. I'm very so sorry some people have vision problems this morning. Bored ape. I never really heard of it. I knew it was a crypto thing, but I didn't realize it was quite so large as it is. If you've noticed this, in Hong Kong they had basically a uh, a bored ape expo. That's right. So people who are into um, crypto, NFTs, shit that is pointless like that, you know, also known as scams, went to this party, this rave, this convent, convent conference thing, and have woke up the next morning suffering from eye burn, extreme pain, impaired vision after attending it because they used UV lights. UV UV lights with no protection. Now, Ape Fest, as you can see here, is a festival for members of the Bored Ape Yacht. So it's for people who've invested in 10,000 fungible, fungible <laughs> tokens. <laughs> what fucking retards. I mean, how annoyed would you be? So not only, let's say you had 200 Gs, just just sat there like we all do, under our bed, cold hard cash. And then suddenly you go, oh yeah, I'm going to invest in a monkey picture. I think that would be really, really good idea for me money. Don't you, Jeff? Where, where do you invest your 200 grand as well. So they invested in a board ape, they lost it all because NFTs are worth shit face nothing and now they've got eye issues, they have eye burn, they are struggling to see, extreme pain impaired vision. I'm not sure what you guys think your opinion on this matter I think uh, eyes are expendable you know what I mean? Who needs them? Just plonk them out, that's what I do, just pull them out you can get fake ones, I'm sure in two years time this is cyberpunk we'll be able to get like weird ones that like see, I don't know, into the future or some shit I don't know, I don't know. so more than a dozen people People who attended Ape Fest in Hong Kong took to social medias telling saying they were suffering from eye pain, vision problems. <laughs> No, we shouldn't laugh. It's very serious. These people could be in some serious, serious pain, bro. Pain. UV sim exposure symptoms. Let's see let's see what it can do. Pain. Just general pain. pain. Almost like my life daily. Let's have a look at the College of Optimet. Optimistrates. I definitely said that wrong. Etiology is condition because it's an unprotected exposure. So you need protection from ultraviolet radiation, obviously. And these bros, like I showed you at the beginning, were getting their rave on, getting their scooch scooch, you know, gun fingers in the air, shaking their behinds to some absolute ketty wobblers. And now they're having discomfort, uh, irritation, severe pain. So they had no eye protection, now they're fucking gone blind. Imagine that, you're pissed, you're hungover, and you can't see properly. I mean, that, for some people that happens, isn't it? So severe photophobia, blepharophasms, lacrimation, blurring of the vision. You know, this is serious shit. I probably presume it can lead to some sort of cancer. We shouldn't laugh at these poor individuals. I mean, look, they're just having a great time getting their scooch scoot on. None of them were wearing UV protection. The guys over in Hong Kong were like, these boys are a bunch of idiots. Maybe they sign something in their T's and C's, right? That if they die, all their 100,000 thingies get sent back to the bit. There's a theory for you, mate. There's a theory. No, but seriously, look, they're just having a good time getting their danking skank on. Poor blokes are now blind, probably never going to be able to see the screen again that they can waste money on, which kind of might be a positive if you think about it. They might get rid of their NFTs now, or might just not be able to sell, uh, buy or sell. It shows how much I know about NFTs, you know. Maybe you should, say, do some research, but why would you research something so boring? Are they worth anything? Anything. They were they were something for like a week, like a whole week, and now they're nothing. What what the fuck's an NFT even do? But just like with all good things, oh look at that guy. Let's take to Twitter or X. It's not called X. Fuck that shit, weirdos. Now, look at that. So they had pictures of all these NFTs up on the screen. So holy shit, that's my one. Anyone's eyes L size burning from last night. Woke up at 3 a.m. with extreme pain. Ended up in the ER. I saw a couple of reports, but just trying to figure out if there was a common thread. <laughs> No, we shouldn't laugh. So far, 30 hours since woke up with severe eye burn. I visited emergency hospitals and eye clinic and spent the total six hours. We shouldn't laugh. We shouldn't laugh. It's not funny. It is kind of cool. It's horrible. These poor NFT heroes. These champions. So they must seek medical help to make sure there's no damage as well. Please get your eyes checked immediately. See so how much it costs the folks. 1,301 Hong Kong currencies, whatever they do. Quick question. I mean, can you not sue them? I mean, look at that. You've been staring at that, and it's UV light. It's fucking huge, mate. Couldn't see anymore. Bored eight conference attendees wake up with searing eye pain. 
Still, as dozens of others, I've almost lost sight this night. They suggest others get their eyes checked up. This is one of the goofiest, one of the most bananas story ever. Imagine going to a rave. They put severe ultraviolet rays beaming down on you for hours and hours. All because of an NFT picture shit. It's bananas. Who makes these events? These poor guys, these kids, whoever they are, might go blind. I just want to clarify, this is obviously a horrible turn of events. I mean, you don't want this to have any long-lasting effects. Here's hoping that it's short, quick, snappy. You go to your doctor, they give you a ibuprofen and it sorts itself out however slightly oh they have a twitter account you know you can't help but slightly think this is one of the funniest stories of the century i mean obviously not great for the people who attended but being someone who didn't attend and can look at it from the outside it seems like an effort an episode of south park it seems like a tv show we are aware that i related issues affect some independent and proactive reaching out to me to just try to find the potential root cause based on the rest of what we believe that there's much less than one percent of those attending work in the event have these symptoms while barely everyone has indicated these symptoms improve we encourage anybody who feels to seek medical attention just in case <laughs> it's barely anyone don't worry about it but also like kind of worry about it go see medical attention seriously it could be seriously kill you it can make you go blind but it's not our fault we did nothing wrong fucking corporate pigs fucking only care about themselves bald ape pricks anyway fuck this shit you know here's a lesson for you don't invest in nfts not only will you lose your money you might lose your eyeballs in the process